Okay, my, uh, my name is Francis Evans uh, and I've been with Global Health right from the start. My experience and expertise is in mind-body connection, really how beliefs and values um, affect one's ordinary natural healing and health issues. The, the evidence, the research that is building up more and more and more all over the world is that we live in a, in a field environment where our experiences are projected out, our emotions affect uh, the whole of our physical experience. We create reality that we finally learn to experience. So I've done research over probably the last 30 to 40 years in understanding how that happens. I've done all sorts of uh, programs. I've taught programs on how to create reality. And I work with people on an individual level of bringing them out so they can see the beliefs they really hold and how to use the technology of their own uh, language patterns to affect change. No matter what practitioner anyone goes to see <coughs> for most health issues, the real, uh, the real uh, evidence or the real thing that they get from the practitioners is that you have to have a lifestyle change. If you want to change your health, you have to have a lifestyle change. If you want to change your uh, level of your financial health as well, you have to change your lifestyle. If you have to want to change anything in your life that makes a difference, you have to change the way you think about it. We, as human beings, get stuck in habits. Habits are real, really, they are mental, uh, they're, they're where the mind gets focused and set on particular, a particular way of thinking. So the techniques that I use to help people to make change are both Neuro Linguistic Programming, or NLP, which really uses the the internal languaging of the neurology of, a, of an individual, how they see, hear, feel and experience, how they, how they uh, turn the external event experience into meaning. Because how we run our lives is based on the meaning that we make of events, not the actual event itself. All of that happens in the unconscious part of the mind. What we know from, from research is that we don't make conscious decisions about anything. Our unconscious minds make the decisions a significant time difference before we get the consciousness of that. So I use a hypnosis and that is natural conversational hypnosis and storytelling to, to help people to get into their unconscious mind and make changes in the mind. One of the things that we know, for example, if I'm working with young children, and I've done some work with children as, as young as six or seven, is that children make sense of their world through stories. So by telling a child a story, they can uh, identify with the characters and learn lessons and make changes by, by that identification. Now the interesting thing is, adults do exactly the same thing. So when we're in a session and we're talking in hypnotic language and telling stories, there, is, there, are, um, there are morals in the stories that help people to make the changes that they need. This is why, uh, if you look at the, you know, to history, we find that the great teachers of history, the Buddha or Jesus or any of the modern uh, Indian gurus or whatever, whoever they are, all made, made their teaching through telling stories 
or jokes or something that made sense and helped the person to make sense of their own life. So I use that to help people to make the shifts in their life that they want to make. So we look at where are we now, unless we, unless we take an inventory of where we are right now at this exact moment and also where we would like to be in the future so that we can see uh, a goal that we are going to attain and where we are starting off from, then the bit in between, that is, the, the challenges that stop us getting there, they are easy to deal with. It's generally the fact that most people do not believe that they can achieve what is possible. Everybody can achieve as long as they work with their own uh, inherent uh, skills and talents. And I help people to find those talents and use them to their best advantage.